Welcome to Sanctum Asylum. I am Keyless, and we are playing Love Esquire. And I know it's been a couple of days, so we're going to try and continue here. And I'll try and remember what I was doing. I'm sure training. Lots of training. Got some Messy's milk. And what we want to do here... Ooh, we could go on a campaign. Maybe we'll do that. Let's see, what, what am I at with everything? It sucks that I have to go all the way back to my room to find out my stats. Here we go. Stats! Ah, okay, so yeah, we should do a campaign. Why not? Why not? Let's see if we can. Even if we don't accomplish it, we still get gold. We still get money. So this will take us, what, three hours... That's a hell of a walk. Well, all right then. I want a toad. We can take this toad too. Frog obtained. Oh, hey. So there's still nothing we can do with her. Nothing. What can you do? So we'll talk to you up for an adventure. Hugh. Let's do this. All right. Epic loot. Here we come. Here we come. That's right. All right. So we are on number six. Start the campaign. Let's do this. We'll try and get out of Hugh's way here. Okay. So we got the Borks and the Poor Ink. So we want to taunt first. So that we'll take damage instead of you. Actually, he's got a lot of health now. That's pretty awesome. Wow. I took a lot of damage there. Okay, let's cheer him on. Yeah, he's taking a good bit of damage. My healing should be pretty good right now, though. There we go. We can, we can heal. Oh. Okay, let's see if we can loot. Oh, we only got one. So, how does that work? So, how much did we get? Do we get more loot every time we loot? So, the more we loot, the more we loot? Interesting, interesting. So we want to taunt because these things do increasing damage. They do more and more damage. Yeah, but they do very little damage. I think they'll I think he'll do eight damage now. So let's heal. Yeah. So it starts over. So it starts over as long as he doesn't hit continuously the same person. That's great. Uh, let's heal again and then we'll loot. Now that feels better. So he'll kill him. Now we've got to go after the Bork. But we'll loot. Let's try and loot. Let's try and get lots of money. I'm coming for that booty! Find anything good? Let's try and loot again. Okay, so we looted. Yeah, see, I don't know. I don't know how the looting works. It's got to be random, right? I don't know. Okay, so let's. Some support you are. Cheer. Let's taunt this time, and then we'll cheer the next time, and then loot until we win. I don't think there's going to be a fourth wave, but man, that would suck if there was. Chair! So he'll take a pretty good amount of damage here. It should be fine. It shouldn't matter that much. Perfect. Perfect. So he should be fine. We're going to loot. Now this is assuming... 
We get a good haul? He'll do 16 damage this time. This is assuming that there's not another wave. If there's another wave, we'll probably die because we spent all this time looting. Right, oh, no there's way. a wave four. Why the hell does that wolf have a med kit? That is weird. Cerulean wolves are smarter than they look, kiddo. That one stole a med kit and learned how to heal its buddies. Really? That's amazing. Sounds like trouble. It is. We better watch out for him. Let's see how much we can heal. And if it's going to be enough. I don't think it is. I think he's going to do, like, a lot of damage. It's coming! It's coming! Okay, let's taunt. You better live up to that trash talk. I might die here. I don't know how this works. I'm helping! Oh, he healed. Oh, it didn't help. Ha! Huh. Heal... Maybe? Yeah, I think if we keep healing, we'll be alright. I don't know. Heal again! He'll heal. Yeah. Which is fine, because it doesn't save him. So... Taunt? Loot. As long as he doesn't die. You find anything good? Cool. Did pretty good. Stage six cleared. I did not think. Wow, we got 266 gold, I think. I think. King's dues. Income tax. Use cut. My gold, 266. That's pretty good. That's great. Um, I keep fishing. I only find a fish like once every 10. I think there's even a, a uh, rare that you can get too. I think. Okay, so it's 4 o'clock. Wow. Let's go to the tavern. No, the archives. We'll go to the archives. We'll do some studying. And then we're going to try and get to level 6 on this. Normie mode. Yeah, it's going to take some time though. Oh my goodness. So let's go ahead and do this. Interesting. So that goes there. Time to go. <laughs> it's time to go to bed. Arrival 11, so we're good. That's fine. That is just fine. We'll go upstairs, we'll go to bed. And then, um. And then we're just gonna train. Oh, look! It's changed. So now we have the most affection with Kamala. And that's what we were going for. So we want to finish the game with her. She's my favorite. I like her a lot. <sighs> but we gotta keep raising... We gotta get that ocarina, I think. Oops. So there's no event, it doesn't look like. Man, that sucks. <clears throat> milk obtained. And we sell the milk, because... Gross, whatever. So I still want to talk to... It's Saturday already? What? I don't know if... I think there's still more I can say to Kamala. So let's try that. And we don't want to raise up anybody else too much. Might as well get the silverware while we're here. Broken earring? Sweet. Think she'd like a broken earring? Come, let us engage in the conversation. Do nobles just throw away their jewelry? What a waste. What a waste. So we can give her something, though. Mm, she doesn't like flowers. I don't think she cares for toads. Let's try this. The act of gift giving is no joke for the Alcosi Squire. Please do remember that next time. Oh, did I lose? No, I just didn't gain anything. I think you just sell it. I Come, think you're supposed to just sell it. In the conversation. Let's see. I know what she likes. Nice to see you, Your Highness. But we're gonna try and wear out her conversation options. A princess like you probably gets gifts all the time. You got anything you like? 
Gifts? Well, according to our cozy customs, as the visiting diplomat, it is I who should be giving out the gifts. I'll take some gifts. Still, though, what kind of stuff do you like getting? Hmm, though I do like shopping for clothes, I would say that I already own too many. Oh, she's a princess. I'm sure she does. The same goes with food. I already have too much of it. And Beatrice is always trying to get me to sample Cerulean cuisine. She's gonna fatten you up. Truth be told, I enjoy giving gifts more than receiving them. Though that is an interesting question. Honestly, I am not asked that very often. Seems like a lot of dialogue for a question that should have a single word answer. I shall give this more thought. Oh, God. Whatever. Oh, relationship with Kamala has increased by 15 points. Oh, that's great. We're so happy. Okay, we already checked in here. There's, there's never anything in there. But then again, it's random, I think. So maybe eventually there will be. Let's head over to, I think, the archives we want to study. We want to study today. Study, study, study. Okay, we do normie mode. Interesting. Otherwise, we would be here for what, like over a week. We would be doing this. We're already gonna be doing this for some time. Do so much to read. Okay, so now it's nighttime. Now we gotta go home, go to bed. Oh, our sister's out here. Oh, not anymore. Maybe she's inside. There she is. What can I do for you? Oh, I can ask her questions too. I don't want to get too much affection with her though. I am curious though. Sis, I just realized I've been living with you guys for years, but I don't really know that much about Pops. What's his deal? Does he have a cool backstory or something? Well, Dad doesn't really like talking about his youth. Even I don't know much about his past. Hmm. But when I asked him, he said he came from some farming village in the far north. What's in the north? Do you think he was a Grugnock or whatever they're called? The the Barbarian? I think he was a Barbarian? But that's just what he wants us to think. If you ask me, I think he was actually raised in the wild by bears. Hmm. Wouldn't have been my theory, but it's a good one. Bears? Yep. You ever see Pops get angry? That guy could wrestle a 30 foot tree and win. <laughs> That'd be a sight. Trust me, bro. It all makes sense. Bears. I like it. I like it. I think it's wrong. But I like it. So go home, go to bed. Rest and save. So it is month two, Monday. Now. We're going to try and raise all of our stats to six, I think. I don't think we'll be able to. We don't have that much money. But if we could at least get some. Now that's going to be interesting. Running out of money. Not being able to train anymore. And having difficulties out in the wilds. I don't know. Maybe I'll... With the money I get, I'll be able to... Um, pretty easily get through it if I don't loot like crazy. Like a madman. So let's go talk to Kamala first. We're going to wear out her dialogue. Why, hello there, squire. Let's try and give her a milk. <laughs> I don't know. Dakra on, squire. Oh, good. She liked it. She won't like it tomorrow. So. Ah, squire. So let's keep asking oh, her about gifts. I know what she likes. I know she likes princess. jewelry, so. Oh, squire. What we talked about the other day. I have finally thought of a gift that I like. Jewelry. Sweet. What is it, princess? Well, when I was a little girl, I remember I came across a curious little contraption in the marketplace. It was crafted in the seaside nation of V. At first glance, it seemed like a simple flask of strangely colored liquid. However, when put under a fire, the liquid would glow a bright blue. Thinking back, it was probably nothing more than a fancy little alchemic trick. This isn't what I expected. A 
after that, I made the mistake of telling uh. my brother that I was interested in alchemy. He <sighs> confiscated the toy, saying that the matters of alchemy were not the work of women. I wonder whatever happened to the glowing lamp. I never saw it again. But ever since then, I've done my best to buy such items if I ever come across them. <gasps> Truly, I'm sure Cerulea has a couple of inventions of their own. I would love to get my hands on one. Okay. Inventions. Inventions? Not what I expected. Makes her more interesting, though. Alright, so let's try and get more forks. Moldy cheese! Mm. Moldy cheese? Oh, nothing today. Oh. Alright, so we've got we got moldy cheese though. So I kinda wanna go to the plaza and just see what a squire like you should buy from a shopkeeper like me. Fancy bouquet, giant grimoire, star compass. That's the only thing I can think. I'll try it. By all means. Keep buying. We'll try it. Now, that's like, this is probably something I shouldn't do until after I've completed the uh, campaign. But I don't know. We're just trying things out. It doesn't matter. All right. Let's get to the next level here. Oh, really? I see. There's a lot of studying. I think I can only study twice a day, no matter what I do. Like, technically, I could study again right now, but that'd be a bad idea. Time to go home, go to bed. It's kind of early, though. Whatever. So we rest. We're working our way towards a relationship with Kamala. The end goal. We are focused. Can we get more milk? Oh yeah, I forgot to sell the milk. That's what I should have done. Now that's one thing I could do every day. Is is find a bunch of gifts and sell them. If I needed to. 8 a.m. Here's Hugh. We're not going on another campaign right now though. Nothing. Why are you up here, you weirdo? Here, we have broken earrings again. Ah, squire, come, let us in. Hmm. So, so there's more to talk about with the gifts. Are you okay, princess? What's on your mind? Oh, greetings, squire. You see, I've been thinking of getting something for Princess Beatrice. I know it must be quite stressful for her, what with the state of her robber. Let me think. Oh yeah, her father's sick. I forget. I could give her jewelry. But I'm sure she already has a lot of that. I've got some moldy cheese that you can just have and give to her. Food, drinks, snacks. Oh, she has at least 20 chefs at her disposal. I'm sure she does not want for anything. Clothes? Oh, I'm afraid our styles of dress are too different. I would not know what clothes she might like. That's true. Well, I'm sure she'd like anything you'd give her. That may be true, but as an Alcozi diplomat, I need to make a good impression. I must do my best. She is royalty after all. Well, you gotta get clever then. I don't know how to help there. So we got 15 points. That's pretty good. Oh, did we give her a gift? Did we forget to give her a gift? We forgot to give her the gift. Okay, let's give her the gift. I don't, have business with me? I don't know. Let's find out. It is a pleasure to receive such a gift from you. I am very flattered. 15 points! Plus the seven! Wow, that's a lot. That's amazing. Okay, so we were right. The star compass, because she likes, like, gadgets and gizmos and, uh, you know, technical stuff that we don't understand. Um... 
yeah, you just go to the archives now. We train up. This should give give us an extra point. And I think that's the only point. The the only. Interesting. Yeah, we don't have enough to to get another point into anything. So. Oh yes, there's no power like brain power. Oh, what what the hell? What are you guys doing here? Oh, it's Princess Kamala. Wonder what she's up to. Hello there, princess. She doesn't look happy. Aww, Squire, I have quite the dilemma. How can I help? Well, what can I do for you? I have been looking around the archives for quite a while now, but I have failed to find a section on the sexual arts. Wait, what? Actually, I think I already found that section, so <laughs> I'd be happy to take her over to it. I don't know. I was hoping to learn more about Cerulean romantic customs and sexual positions. That's curious. Se se sexual positions? <laughs> A culture such as yours would no doubt be able to provide valuable insight into such a matter. Hmm. Could they perhaps be in the restricted section? I wonder if I could be allowed access. Why would they not be in the restricted section? find what you're looking for there wait of course it did not occur to me Alcos has one as well so could it be that your books on sexuality have an entire building of their own holy crap <laughs> what they have an entire building dedicated to sexual novels i wish but sadly that's not really the case see stuff like that is pretty cool among the common folk you know but the nobles think stuff like sex is lewd. Truly? But there is nothing lewd about exploring the sensations of the body. You'll get no argument from me. Indeed. The Sark Fal Arfun is an important part of life. Shark Farfun? What's that? <laughs> Sark Fal Alfun, the dance of souls, Alcos' most ancient teachings and philosophies regarding the pleasures of the flesh. She's talking about banging. Indeed, such teachings must be laid bare for the entire kingdom to partake in. Reach it, princess! <laughs> Without books on the matter, how does one come to know of the 295 positions of pleasure? 295? I think I know of three. 295? You told me there were only two. <laughs> <gasps> Does that mean you are unaware of the 25 Neon Taka of foreplay? W what's a foreplay? I'm up for learning. <gasps> and what of the coital rope sensations of Carosa? Rope? <laughs> <laughs> oh, we're getting into bondage now. Hmm. Please tell me you at least know of the same-sex pleasure of Rizanti. No, definitely not. Uh, same-sex? Oh, dear. Your people have much to learn. I, I'm completely <laughs> outmatched. Yeah. I know nothing. Oh, wait. Does this mean that Beatrice is also unaware of the Starkfall Alphone? I don't think this is the kind of gift that you give to a princess. How the hell would I know? Oh, this is most distressing. I will not stand for this. A trade of knowledge must be arranged. You do you, man. I must teach her. Now. Oh my god, can I watch? Teach her? How? Are they gonna... I, I don't mind seeing that. That's awesome, man. That was the most fun dialogue with her so far. That was awesome. All right, so. Wow, we got 45, too. Did I? Always glad to be of assistance. Yeah, I already gave her a gift. I can't give her another one. No, this is where I need to be, though. Gosh. She's got me so distracted now. I forgot what I was doing. <laughs> All right, so. We want to do normal mode. Oh, really? I see. I think we were actually supposed to go out on a uh, expedition or campaign. So yeah, she does. She's got me all fuzzy in the brain. I'm thinking about all this stuff now. All right, so let's go to bed. Mm-hmm. 
And then I think we'll do a campaign today. Because we need more money. <sighs> oh, we gotta get that money. So let's see. Yeah, they're outside. Perfect. Oh, but there's like a whole thing up here. Damn, so we're gonna have to miss today. Because these always take four hours. I don't know why. Man, being a squire is great. I get to wander around the castle, and more importantly, they just leave around these fancy boxes with sweets in them. Don't mind if I do. Squire, I am glad to have caught you. I must ask a favor. Anything for you, princess? Ask away, your highness. As a squire, you are supposed to be strong, correct? The key word being supposed to be. Well, not to brag, but I've actually wrestled with a wild boar or two. Great. I knew I could rely on you. Follow me. Please, princess. You can always, always rely on me. All right, so. Look at all these shoes, Shadia. Why would she need strength for shopping? I knew this was coming. I knew it. Kamala, why is he here? Hey, come on. We're friends, right? Sort of. I needed the company. You mean someone to carry your stuff? <laughs> I'd say it's very reasonable of her to think of you as a servant. Oh. <laughs> Princess Kamala, you didn't know Princess Beatrice was going to tag along. I cannot just leave an important guest unattended. Besides, there is no point in staying inside the castle today. Oh, is it the problem with the Nasha still? Nasha? Yes. The mouse traps I've been setting do not seem to be working. The sweets I put inside just magically disappeared. <laughs> I've been eating them. Either the mice have gotten smarter, or some imbecile inside the castle has been eating them. <laughs> Oh! <laughs> that, that's very diligent of you, your highness! <laughs> of course! What do you take me for? My friends, let us calm down. Please join me in this day's happiness. Very well, I could use a break. I wonder if we give the moldy cheese to Beatrice and she could use that. It'd make for a better mouse trap or a mouse. Enticement? Yeah. All right. How could I say no to you? Splendid! Now, onward to the shoe merchant. <laughs> Stop! Thief! Oh, that sounds like a job for me. Ladies, I'll be right back. Squire, wait! <laughs> Someone! Stop him! Okay, Squire. It's your moment to shine. Stop! This won't end well! Oh, there's the thief. The kid picks up speed. He almost gets away. But as he turns right at a crossing... Ah! Oh my god. Right into a cart of apples. Ugh, tough luck. It's off to jail for you. Her. <sighs> you! M me? Oh, oh. Aren't you, Sir Hugh Squire? <laughs> oh, I appreciate the bravery. <laughs> <laughs> Just doing my job. <sighs> Guards, arrest the thieving brat! What did he take? The squire! Kamala, what is... Oh, my! Lord Craig. Your Highness. Oh, it's a lord. Huh. Ain't he the guy that Pepper Swindler mentioned? I. We just caught this criminal. Squire, do not run off like that. Oh, okay. Can't help it. Comes with the job description, your highness. And I describe it as a job well done. Now to the dungeon with this fool. I want at least 20. Nay, 50 lashes. F 50? Wait. Uh, that would kill a man. Wait, please. He could die from that. Yeah. You 
cannot just brutally punish such youth. We can in Cerulea, princess. He's lucky. We traditionally chop off a thief's good hand for stealing. Plus the 50 lashes. Ho, ho, ho. This will be a show. Jesus, you might as well just kill the kid. Jeez. Beatrice, what is this? You cannot let this happen. This man is young. Just a, a boy and... Princess, the law says I have every right to do so. Every piece of filth has to answer for its crimes. What was he stealing? It might have just been food. He might just be hungry. What's this all of a sudden, your highness? I will not let this rat's crime go unpunished! We're not saying that. Then, then punish me instead. Oh my god. Fifty or a hundred even. I shall take this child's crime as my own. Kamala! Princess, do not let this... this foreigner meddle in our affairs. She has already done enough. I am... I am meddling? Meddling? My lord, he is just a boy. Where is your heart? If I didn't have one, he'd be dead. Dead! Have you... have you no sense of morality? Do you not have an inkling of it in that body of yours? You? An Alcozy questioning my morals? Listen here, you clueless wretch. Whoa. You have already meddled in my affairs once. It will never happen again, nor will I allow you to meddle in any of Cerulea's affairs again. That rat has committed a crime and rightfully deserves a punishment. Unless you also count yourself a rat. Your Highness. Mm -hmm. You... you dare... You dare?! You spineless, heartless piece of... Princess Kamala! Kamala, that is enough! I... I did not mean to. I, I apologize, Beatrice. Might I remind you that that rat stole from me? It's my right! I said enough, Lord Dreg. This ignorant outsider has made you soft. Enough! Any more insults to the king's guest will be tantamount to treason. Holy shit. Quite clear, my lord. Finally stepped in, huh? Ugh. I make myself clear, Understood. Now, if you'll excuse me, your highness. Yikes! Guards, to the prison with that boy. No punishments until I say so. Beatrice, forgive me. I did not mean to intervene. I mean, she's not wrong. That's a tough situation. It's like telling somebody else how to raise their kid, you know? They might be in the wrong, but can you really tell them... How to raise their kid? That's tough. This is a problem, I admit, but I have caused the rift between you and that noble. I think the rift was already there. <laughs> that guy's a dick. See, this is the problem with the voice, the voiceovers is like the volume is wonky sometimes. I couldn't hear that at all. But we will have to discuss this some other time. If there is anyone to blame at the moment, it is the squire. What? What the hell did I do? Hey, I was just doing my job. And we would also not be in this mess if you were not so overzealous. Well, true, but <laughs> you still have a criminal running around. <sighs> anyway, shall we continue this trip? Oh my, did you see that? I certainly did. The next thing you know, she'll be interfering with the affairs of our kingdom. I hope the princess knows what she's doing. She doesn't. The lady knows that child will be our downfall. Her and that godless heathen. Fuck. Rude. Beatrice, may we head back to the castle? I am... I am no longer feeling well. No. Perhaps we may shop some other time. Very well. Will you be all right on your own, Kamala? 
I will be Beatrice. Do not worry. I will settle this matter personally. <laughs> I have dealt with worse in the past. I... I trust in you, Shadia. It will be well placed. And I hope I deserve yours. <sighs> she is angry. Princess, do you want some time alone? Oh, okay. I'll just... S Squire! Oh, wait! What is it? Squire, what do you think? What I think? Yes, you were there, were you not? It would put me at ease to hear your voice on this matter. Well, it's hard to say. <sighs> a person reformed is better than a person beaten and angry. So, yes, it was wrong to steal, but instead of you know, killing him, you could put some money and effort into making him understand why it was wrong and giving him the the ability to, you know, maybe he was stealing because he was hungry. Maybe he didn't have the money. I don't know. But, um, yeah, I mean, if, if you could set him up to be a gainfully employed citizen, then, you know, that would be better than just killing him you gave that noble a piece of your mind but now it looks like your mission might be a bit harder yeah yes it will be i think you did something right at least the boy probably needed that gold to live a few more days yeah he stole gold i know i've been there i thought the farm had always been your home mm -mm. i got lucky thanks to the help of a kind knight. <laughs> it is rare to hear you praise Knight Hugh. I know. Don't tell him I did that. <laughs> anyway, what you did for that boy maybe help him not kill me. You know, to do something with his life. And maybe he'll waste it. But whatever it is, you gave him a chance. That's just my take on it. People cannot recover in solitude. People need help, and that's that's like a confused thing in our society right now, is, is people can't heal themselves, you know? You need help. That is an interesting perspective. You have my gratitude, Squire. You feeling better now? <sighs> in all honesty, I still am not the nerve of that noble! <laughs> Want me to kick his ass? He is a postulant swine, a horse, a stinking piece of bullshit. Hey, hey, calm down. No, I'm glad that you didn't go all out. He is an an eyesore. I am already in difficulty with the other nobles, and he comes in and makes things worse. I do not need any more distractions. I know she likes to call people bullshit. She uses that wrong. Holy Lady of the Lake. Didn't know she could get this angry. Let it out. Kamala, it's not that you don't need less distractions. You just need a good one. I... I do not understand. You know, a good distraction. Something to let all that anger out. Bottling up all that rage won't be good for you. Indeed. I think I may have accumulated a number of facial wrinkles due to the recent stress. <laughs> a little more of this, and I may start to look like Shira. <laughs> you still look the same to me, but whatever. You know what? I think I have the perfect solution for this. Let's go drinking! <laughs> oh, nice! D drinking? At the... at the alehouse? Well, yeah. Heck yeah! Think about it. You can rant all you want and drink your troubles away. It... It is a very tempting proposition, but a lady such as myself must not be caught intoxicated. It is inappropriate. That's fair. Come on, haven't you seen your father get drunk? On several occasions, yes. Or your little brother? Come on, you're older than him. Y yes, but... Uh... So why can't you? Why do dear old dad and bro get all the fun, and you don't? I... Uh... 
I shall think about this endeavor and uh Nah, -uh. enough of this thinking. You don't need that right now. <laughs> what you need is a taste of Cerulean tavern culture. Consider this another tour. I <sighs> Very well. You have convinced me. I will let you know when I am ready for this escapade. I promise you won't regret this. Thank you. I am already in higher spirits. <laughs> oh. Great! Oh, and Kamala? Yes, Squire? Please don't tell Princess Beatrice that I ate her rat bait. <laughs> oh, dear. Should this be another one of our secrets? Yes, if you keep quiet about it. Then I suppose... I suppose I shall respect your trust in me. Mm. Nice. Thanks. Well then, I will be expecting you soon. Heck yeah. She needs this. Heck, I need this. That was fun. I enjoyed that one. Only by 30? That sucks. Wait, did I give her a gift today? Did she want to have a conversation? Uh, I don't have much. I think I think the milk is fine. Your concern means much to me, Squire. Thank you. Wait, what? It's just milk. Let's see if we can get up some silverware or something. What's this? You got something for me? Oh, good boy. It's you. Know, the silverware again. I think I just sell that crap. No more moldy cheese. So it's twelve. PM? Here, we'll stop by here, the plaza. This pretty face has some pretty items for sale. So, I don't... I know she likes, like, the jewelry box and stuff. I don't think she'd like tarot cards. And I don't think there's a whole lot of other things. Um, we're gonna do the Star Compass again later. So, we really need to sell, like, I don't know what to do with that moldy cheese yet. Let's sell all of this. And then that actually gives us enough. A we can buy some. Like you should buy from a shopkeeper like me. Here, we'll buy this. That's a fine. fine choice. All right. Now we go train at the archives. So much to do, so much to read. I did not mean to do this again. <laughs> I just... I, 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 I just started doing it. I should have moved on to the tavern or something. Okay, time to go home. We will go to bed. This episode will be over. And on the next episode... We'll try and do that scene with... With uh, Kamala. Go to the bar. We'll see if we can get that going. Thank you for joining me. And I will see you on the next episode.